Students in Flathead County will not be returning to the classroom today. School officials say investigators continue to probe a cyber threat that forced all schools to close on Thursday and Friday. Law enforcement will spend the day today assisting schools with security assessments and will maintain a presence in the affected schools until the suspect has been apprehended or the threat is discredited. The suspect hacked into the Columbia Falls School District network and gained access to phone numbers of students, staff and parents. The suspect then began electronically contacting a small group of parents with graphic personalized threats on Saturday. Authorities say they have no information that would lead them to believe the suspect is from the Flathead area. Whitefish School Superintendent says that all staff in the Whitefish School District and schools throughout Flathead Valley will report to school today, but students will return on Tuesday. A 15-year-old was taken into custody and faces a felony charge after threatening a Great Falls High School student on Friday night with a BB gun. According to the Great Falls Police Department, they received reports of a group walking around the Great Falls High School parking lot with a gun around 9.15 p.m. The group reportedly told onlookers they were about to commit a robbery. Police located the group of minors and found a BB gun, pistol, a knife with a 7-inch blade, and a set of brass knuckles. The police also received a report that a 16-year-old female student felt threatened by a group member with the BB gun. The GFPD spoke with the 16-year-old female and then arrested a 15-year-old male who faces a felony charge of assault with a weapon. We are not publishing the name of the suspect taken into custody due to his age. Two minors were also cited for a concealed weapon, which is a misdemeanor. Those individuals were released to their parents.